So we recently closed a $20,000 deal on some AI and automation or an AI and automation project. And um, getting into the project, I then realized that some of the stuff that should be really easy was actually quite hard. And that's a general theme when you work in, in a new field like this, because we had to do a lot of video translations. And these videos lived on Vimeo and they were really large. So we had like 500 videos. That's not the problem. The problem is that they, some of the videos were like over two gigabytes in size, and creating an automation system that can handle that type of file size isn't just as straightforward as it may seem because once you start to download the files into the various automation platforms, stuff will stop working. It's just simply like we don't have the capacity to download such fi large files. And then you get into the, well, how do I get around this? And the answer I came up with, I don't know if it's the right one, but at least the one that I did was I created some custom software. So I made my own software using a Gypsy Codex, hosted that. So I had some API endpoints, had some front end, had some APIs coupled with that. So I could get around the fact that I couldn't download these large files into the automation software. Instead, we used a multi-part upload to an S3 bucket, and then we handled the automation in that manner. But it just goes to show that even though you think you know, like I know the process and you may know the process as well for doing automations, but you run into all these niche topics or edge cases where like this just doesn't work because we're over the limit now. And then you have to think out of the box and figure something out. Just want to share 